This medical team is from Louisville's Humana Hospital, Audubon. Heading the team is heart surgeon Alan Lansing. With him are doctors, nurses, technicians, and support staff. This is no vacation. They're here to work. To get them here, it took the combined efforts of Humana and Rotary Clubs in Kentucky and Panama. Dilated pulmonary artery, I think, is producing the clicks. Right. Cardiologist Fred Arnsman helps Dr. Lansing reconfirm earlier diagnoses. These children were born with some of the most common heart defects. Up until now, children who needed open heart operations were being sent to Louisville through the Gift of Life program. But now, through that same program, surgeons in Panama are being trained to do the work. The operating room is crowded. This is a learning experience for many members of the staff. Jeff Poland teaches his counterparts in Panama how to run the heart-lung machine. This is a pediatric setup that is much smaller. Uh, basically, they have not used this small equipment before. The surgery is a success, but the training isn't over yet. Many children survive open-heart operations only to have life-threatening problems a few hours later. Sharon Rule's specialty is intensive care. The sooner you recognize, which is a key for the nurses, is to be aware of the signs of problems so that they can intervene early and stop any possible uh, further complications. Ricardo Paredes' surgery is a first in Panama. It's the source of a lot of national pride and excitement. For Ricardo's parents, the real miracle is not having to send him hundreds of miles away for the operation. We wanted to comfort our child and give him the assurance that he knows we love him. We are here. We will be waiting for him. And we will be beside him when he gets out of the operation. Ricardo's recovering quickly from his open heart surgery. Before long, he'll be as active as any other seven-year-old. His mother is grateful Ricardo's been given the gift of life. Gracias. Gracias.